Uh, Kenneth, uh, so you own uh, m m Records? Yeah. How long have you uh, had that business? Approximately going on five years. Five years? Okay. And so uh, you get a call to this morning that your I business is on call, fire. I just got a call probably about 15 minutes ago. I was told saying that the building was on. A lot of smoke was coming out of the building. Okay. And I'm like, well, what's going on? What's wrong? And we don't know. So by the time I get here, everybody else is Right, everybody else is here, and uh, so, uh, how long have you, did you say you had this business? Close to five years. Five years, and uh, tell me what, what all kind of records do you have in there? Just gospel, urban, uh, mixed, uh, blues, R&B, just different things like that. Right, yeah. and uh, some, a lot of memories in that place then, I guess. It's uh, probably 72. Since 72? Wow. Uh, that's been in my wife's family. Oh, been in your wife's family. The, the, the store has? Yes. And you've owned it for five yes. years? So wow. so since 1972, it's been in the family. Yes. Wow, that's that's a lot of history there. Um, so there's probably a lot of memories that are, are gone. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That's sad to see that. Uh, yeah. Had any... Any indications there was any problems in the building or like le electrical problems or anything like that or? I don't know. We don't know exactly what all went on. Uh, we just have to take note and find out. Uh, hopefully we'll hear something from the chief shortly. I asked him to uh, see who was in charge. He said the guy over with the red hat. So. With the red hat. There you go. <laughs> 